Hello everyone, I hope you're well. Now today's clip once again features my old mate Tony Shuffleburger and in this clip he talks about the mindset behind blending with an attack. Now a theme that runs throughout Aikido and for that matter many other martial arts is this idea of redirecting force. Now I really like the, the semantics or the, the words Tony uses in this clip to describe the idea of respecting the attack and accepting what's going on and just moving with what's happening and redirecting it off the line. Now there's lots of good stuff in this. I hope you find it useful as well. If you do, of course, normal stuff, smash below, consider subscribing. And uh, if you've got any comments, be interested to see what you think below. Thanks for watching. gone down this journey and I realised I'm not one of these sports martial artists, I'm not one of these ones that wants to get in there and, and, and go hammer and tong with somebody, but I do want to find this essence, this belief in myself, the structural awareness, this thing that gives me options and makes me seem stronger without using any energy or anger or anything else. So my journey was about improving me, if that makes sense. Okay? Because we did a Nikkyo earlier and you were doing it from a punch, Let's explore that. So Jason, where are you? Wait, it's Russ. <clears throat> okay. Let's take this awareness of our connection to somebody else and do something. So when he throws this punch, if I, if I stand here underneath it, I'm going to end up in a pretty bad place. So the first thing we need to do is get offline, as they used to talk about. So I want to come offline. So would you like that hand to come this way? Right? Okay. The second thing I'm doing is I'm gluing with this hand. I'm actually encouraging that punch to go through because I don't want him to be doing this too much. So I'm actually encouraging it to go through. I want him to keep it out here. So this subconscious gluing is causing this hand to go slightly more than where he was intending to be because he was intending to be structurally sound. But I've invited him just that little bit off his structural base. The next thing I want to do hey. now is not fight with his bodily strength. So when I roll my shoulder, it already rolls his shoulder. So his shoulder's already come forward. Which means now when I drop my hip underneath, he'll go down into Ikkyo. Okay? And I could use the old fight system with it, or I can use this system where I'm actually inviting him to collapse in his own structure. I'm actually inviting him to go slightly over, and I'm inviting his shoulder to the tip. So, you know, I'm really looking at the fact that I can join the energy. I've got to respect the fact and he can throw a punch. I really want to enjoy that. Yeah. Oh, smack me in the head. Oh, that's nice. I like it. So I've got to respect it. I've got to go, oh, I've got to do something with this. So I've joined it. I've invited it in. And this all again comes down to this confidence within yourself that I can do this. I know when I did weapons and I used to, hey. we used to do our weapons and I, oh no, I'm getting run over. Until I went, Oh, that's a nice one. How are you going? I started to connect to it. So let's take it to the Ikkyo. This hand is inviting it to come forward. The second hip, or this when I turn in, is here. But because I roll my shoulder up and over, it invites his shoulder to go up and over. So I'm not fighting like this. I'm actually inviting the, the ball joint to, to do its natural thing. And then the second thing is what we used to call weight underside of gravity. So once I invite his shoulder to unhook, all I have to do is drop weight through his body structure to invite him to fall. So we're, we're smarter, not harder, if you like. We're enjoying the fact, oh, look, what's going on here? Oh, that's a nice piece of ground. You know. But it's that confidence. or the Again, this is totally about... Hey! having confidence in, in blending in yourself. So now we've got timing, my eyes, Anshin, all these things are starting to come into play. Ah! He governs the speed. He governs the connection. Now it's no good me thinking, I've got to be fast. Oh, hey. oh hang on, he wasn't fast. <laughs> hang on, maybe, no, no, maybe I've got to be stubborn. Ah! Oh, now I'm stuck. I've got to connect to this person, so I say respect him. Oh, he's good. He's going, oh, look, that's really nice. I'll come and join you. Yeah? A lot of it's your own awareness and confidence to connect. 
So that's just a couple of minutes to finish off with. Thank you, Jason. Have a go.